Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will show you how to fetch products from external API and add them to your Shopify store using Node.js. We will use the fake store API to get the products data and then use the Shopify API to add these products to your store. So let's get started. Before we begin, here are a few things you will need. Node dot js and npm install on your machine a shopify shopify store with admin access and shopify api credentials api key and password and uh, shopify store url and basic understanding of javascript make sure you have your development environment set up if you need help with this check out my previous videos so First, let's set up our product. I have this app.js and I have installed these modules, Axios, Shopify, add.env, and I have saved my credentials, Shopify API key, Shopify API password, and Shopify store name in pros in .env file. And I, I fetched them over here. And then I created the Shopify instance. I am using a Shopify API node module. So this is how we create, we create the Shopify instance. Okay, the next thing we are going to do, we are going to write a function to fetch the product from external API. So let's write the function async function fetch products and in this function, we will have try and catch block. And then in the case of error, we will console.log error fetching products from the fake store API. And here we will pass the error. And also, we are going to return the empty array. Okay, in try block, we will have a variable cons response. And we will make get request and await axios dot get request. And here, then here we will pass the uh, fake store API URL that is HTTPS fake store API dot com slash products roasts once we get the response we will return response dot data Okay, so this is our fetch function. Let's, let's run this function. Okay, we need another function, a sync function rain. And here we will get the products. Product is equal to await and we will fetch products like this. And let's console dot log products and run this function lane okay node app node js we have successfully grabbed the products now we need another function to add these products into the shopify store so let's write a function for that a sync function add products to Shopify and we will pass products products here okay we will loop through all the product first so for that we need for loop for const product of products and here 
we will have the product object. Now let's create the uh, new product object that will we will pass into the Shopify. So const new product is equal to an object and title will be product dot title which is coming over here this one and then we will have body underscore html that will be product dot description and vendor will be fake store and product type will be product product dot category which is coming over here category and then we will have uh, some variants so I'll type variants in the variants array we are going to pass the object option Op let's name it option 1 and default get in the price we are going to pass product dot price to string and then we will pass the sq and sq will be product dot id to string function and after the variant we need to pass the images for images array we need image object and here we will pass the source of the image URL product dot image which is coming over here so add the comma here and also correct the spellings okay now we have this function so let's run in this function over here, columns. And we will await for that. Await. Add products to Shopify. And I will pass products here. And let's remove this console. Load. So now. Now we need to write a function over here to create the product in the Shopify. We have the object already here, this one. And after that, we are going to write the create product create function that will be in a try catch block, try catch and here console dot log. Hellers creating the product product in case of in Shopify in case of any error we will print out the error and in try block we will have a variable calls response okay await Shopify dot product dot create this function will create the product and we will pass the new product over here and here we will console dot load product created successfully and here we will pass response dot Title. title title of the product 
So I think our code is good now. Let's try to run the file. And as you can see, our products are being added in the Shopify product created successfully. This is the product is done. Okay. So these products are being added in the Shopify. So let's go to the Shopify store and go to the products and sort out the products created annually and reload this. And do you see we have a new products? These are the new products which we just added over here. And one, two, three, four, five. So let's try to search this product. If I search this product, it takes some time to to display in the Shopify store. Let's try again. And now you see we have that product over here. And we have the product title, product description, image, and the variant, price, everything which we, we done have. So this is how you can add products in bulk using Shopify API and using Shopify Node API module. Uh, please let me know if you have any questions. And please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And if you have, if you need any help with your Shopify projects, uh, you can contact me through Fiverr or Upwork. I will add the links in the description. Thank you for watching.